Today, you probably didn't know, is actually College Savings Day, and we have a special guest joining us this morning to talk about a 529 savings plan. George Williams, the founder and president of Williams Financial Group, here to explain the day and how to save smart for college. We were just talking. I, I, I didn't know that uh, a College Savings Day is on a weekend, a National College Savings Day, but apparently today is the day, huh? Today is the day. Talk about a 529 savings plan, because I don't think a lot of people know what it is. All right. A, what is it? A 529 savings plan is a way to save for educational expenses. Um, it is to grow the money tax-free, and you're able to use the money for private school tuition, K-12, through college tuition, room and board, books, and because of the SECURE Act of 2019, you're also able to use that money for trade schools, apprenticeships, and $10,000 to pay back student loans. Why is this so important as parents are listening and watching right now? I mean, how much money could this potentially save somebody if they use it? So there are two types of college savings plans. Um, there's a savings plan, which is the most common use, and that savings plan allows the money not just to grow tax-free, but allows you to guide where that money is invested at as well. And then there's a prepaid tuition plan. That prepaid tuition plan um, is allowing you to lock in today's rate if your child's going away to college yeah. in the next couple of years. Tell us what are some different tips to save and also invest in a 529 savings plan? Um, there are, the tips are this. Um, I don't believe that you want to put away saving for retirement to save for your child's education. You might find in the long run that being a little, um, you might not be as happy in the long run if you do that. But if you're able to do that, um, you're able to send your child away have great. a great college education. Yes, yes, yes. Um, what is, so what are the different types of things that you want people to know about your business? And this is something that I would assume you guys offer. Yes, yes, yes. Um, here at Williams Financial Group, we believe that everyone should put away between 10 to 15% of their salary away in a 401k plan sponsored by your employer. And if you can't put away 10 to 15%, at least put away the match. Yeah. Now, here at Williams Financial Group, listen, we our clients are like family to us. So we want to ensure that they have confidence, control, and comfort going into retirement. Um, so making sure that their financial structure is set up in a way that they're able to do the things that they want. What if a child doesn't end up going to college? I mean, think about all the different professions where you really don't need a, uh, a four-year college education. Okay, so how, how, why should somebody still invest in one, or should they? Jonathan, listen, I have five kids, the oldest one being 20. Um, things change. <laughs> but here's the thing. If the child does not use that money for college expenses or education expenses, then you must be able to understand there's going to be federal and state income tax to come along with that and a penalty as well. But there are three ways to get away from that penalty. Um, the first one, if the child gets a tax-free scholarship. The second one, if the child goes to the military academy. The last one, if the child becomes disabled or passes away. Um, how expensive uh, is college getting? What are you hearing from the families and the customers that you have just about how expensive the four years are, if not more? Okay, listen, let me tell you. So my 20 year olds in college now. And when I went to school, I paid for college. I was able to go to school at night and pay for college in the day, right? <laughs> I can't imagine Things my 20 year old doing that. Yes, um, the, well, I paid for college I'm not going to tell my age now, but back then, <laughs> my 20-year-old, one year is almost what it cost me four years ago school. Yeah. With. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? It is real crazy. So this is a reason why somebody needs a 529 savings plan out big there. Big reason. Yeah. Big reason why someone needs a 529 plan. Uh, George, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. George Williams, ladies and gentlemen.